Talking Normies Podcast. Hey. hey, what's up? What up, y'all? It's the Talking Normies Podcast. We're the Normies and we're talking. Oh, I'm so excited to talk. My name is Chris. My name is Jansen. My name is Mickey. I am Pat. I am Serge. Hey. We got a bunch of goon boys here today getting ready to talk with you guys about some stuff and things. Uh, before we get started, though, I want to say shout outs to all y'all. I also want to say that there is a Super Secret Girls Club podcast with a new set, new rules, new girls. All right, all the girls are the same, but all that's there. So go check out their podcast. New day, new time of day, Wednesday. Yeah, new every Wednesday. You're going to get this on Fridays. You're going to get them on Wednesdays. What time um, on Wednesdays? 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock. And if you miss shit, if you, if you come early, you, you might be treated to uh, uh, a little pregame. We did Whoa, a little pregame before yeah. this podcast about deodorant. It's hey. going to be posted on our secondary YouTube channel where all of our podcast posts, gang, in gang, case gang. you can't stick around for the whole thing or you miss it in the future, yeah. our podcast will live on the Normies podcast channel. Yep. And we out. won't get into it too deep, but if you guys want to know what it looks like when we experience period cramps, that's a thing that's going to be happening too. Oh, yeah. guess it which was, channel that's, that's going to be on the Super Secret Girls? I didn't Club, think it was going to be accurate, and then Marquetta tried it, and she was like, "You know, it's pretty accurate." I was like, "Dang, that, mm-hmm. that's got to be." Well, on say, don't spoil. Don't spoil. Yeah, don't, don't don't spoil. Oh, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. Well, well, well. <laughs> weekend catch up. I mean, we all have the same weekend. weekend I thought the weekend must. Ah. <laughs> I'm gonna get my agent in here. I can't work under these conditions. <laughs> we we grab the same energy from the air. Chris. What are you munching? Um, banana boy eating a banana uh so yeah we had a fun weekend i would say that our weekend technically started like so for me last wednesday i went to the doctor and got my blood drawn and passed out so i had a really shitty day then and then i tried to recover the next day which was thursday and a bunch of people for normicon were in town and then friday started normicon so i've had like a really long seven days of just being like I don't know if I'm gonna make it, but yeah. I don't know if I'm Belt's recovered back. yet. I don't Same know. Same here. No, I'm Actually, not I, I think I'm either. back. I think I'm back. Because even on our, our like uh, rest day, like we, we were still like out yeah. and about with people, so like I'm I'm still like, like what, Wednesday went to like 3 a.m. Thursday 3 a.m. I, I feel like I didn't go to bed till 3 4 and then 5 on the last day. What, what time did we Saturday morning? I mean Sunday morning. When did we go to bed? <laughs> I think I think Saturday morning was the latest we. But so I got home at like one, and I know that y'all stayed out at least four oh, no, hours. No, no, yeah, no, no, no. Sunday with the fire pit night. No, that was, sa- that oh. was Saturday. That was Sunday, Saturday. Sunday well, no, morning. That is Sunday morning. Yeah, Why oh, would yeah. you say it like that? Yeah, yeah, it was, yeah, like, it was five and thirty in the morning. <laughs> 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 yeah, like, we when we think morning, we okay, think like look, nine, if, ten o'clock Sunday look, morning. Sun was, no, no, people were getting up for church. No, no. If you go to sleep and you wake up, then it's the morning. But if you stay awake through it, it's still Saturday. night. Yeah. I'm gonna make you on Saturday that. night slash <laughs> Sunday morning. When does it become what if you when, you go when the sleep, sun comes when up? You if, the, if you see the sun, yeah, then okay, it's official. See, yeah, when you see the sun, then you can be like, um, okay, Sunday. That you can go, morning, you can go out to brunch and it'll still be like last night. That yeah, <laughs> <laughs> just, just running on it. All right, so that night I don't know, probably like f- five, definitely. So let's let's start with day I'm one. Man, I'm Normicon. Normicon. Wait, day what, one. What about pre? Yeah. Okay, hold on. Let's start with. God, day yeah, zero. the unofficial, day zero. unofficial Hold Thursday. On, if, if that was day one, day that'd zero. have been day, day zero. zero. Day we, zero. I think we just started day minus one. Day negative one. Because that's when Gio <laughs> and Ellie came into town. And even though see, they like, um, day, I don't think. like what? work with the channel, we still went out and we did like a little bit. I think we had like a celebratory. Yeah, you guys are in town. We're going to get started ready for Normicon. Yeah, look, we don't, we don't guarantee minus hanging one. out with people showing up early to Normicon. It was just our buddy JJ. He had just done his Lego thing. We had the mods visiting from Europe, like he said. So... Day negative it was like, one. It was like Day company. negative one was, like, was, was a like mild a, start. It was like yeah. a company thing because they like me. They like work with us. Too, yeah. You know? Yeah. How about we'll describe it like this? You know, when you get into a really hot hot tub, day minus one was just your feet getting in. Yes. Day zero, we're up to the knees. Now day okay. zero. We oh, we that, were lit those days. That was pretty we lit. That was Thursday, right? Yeah. That was pins. That was, that was pins. pins. Garage yeah. Pins. Garage pins. pins. Garage lit. What else did we do that night? We, um, went, uh, we went to 16 bit. We scooted around. We got pizza. Bit. Yeah. Oh, we did get pizza. Unveiled. Oh, we had a speaker party up and down the street. Yeah. yeah. That was actually super fun. Dang. I totally uh, forgot all about Nisa that. Nisa shit on the floor and pins. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dire, explosive diarrhea. Oh. They get a mop? They get a bucket and a mop for I that wet that ass? I shit quick before anyone could see it. Did, did you just do like get, a, So he asked for something and they didn't have any. So they just gave a... Oh, I think it was like one piece of napkin or something <laughs> like that. I'm like, what the fuck is he going to do with Whoa, one hold piece? Hold on. You, you didn't just do a sock mop? What the fuck is a sock mop? When you a just take your shoe off and just sop it up with your sock. 
Oh! Then what you gonna do with the sock? <laughs> Throw it away. Then how you gonna walk under the shoes? You got shit on the bottom of your foot. You wash your foot off in the sink at the bathroom. Ugh! Sock mop. Everybody I feel like knows. I can smell it. Yeah. <laughs> Just feel it in between your toes? <laughs> like oh, wet sand? Oh, I feel it in my fingers. <laughs> feel it. Uh, stop it, stop it. Thursday was good, though. It was the first time we got to meet a lot of people, put a lot of names to faces. It was insane. Um, which was really exciting. Um, shout some. I shout some. Oh. Johnny Blue. Watchdog. Oh, just, just Thursday. Just Thursday names. And yeah, just we'll, Thursday. We'll, get, we'll oh, grab the list. We should just do it all at once. Bracteer was there. Bracteer. Yeah, because we thought we lost him. The Watcher mm-hmm. of Dogs. Bunkin. Johnny Blue. Johnny uh, Blue. Ryan of New York. Ryan. Chelsea. Queen, Chelsea. Maria. Maria. Jess. Manny. Manny. Jess. Joe Mags. Quite Yo a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Don't worry. There were quite a lot of people. Just, just Thursday for the unofficial meetup. Oh, yes, unofficial. Like, my bad. My bad. Right. But, but, but it was advertised on Discord as the unofficial meetup. So. <laughs> that was yeah. That's the pregame, pre-day. Just yeah. to get, just to get your bodies just ready. Little, just to punch <laughs> your liver one extra time. <laughs> Tenderize your like your muscles. Just get it ready. Well, see that that's that's the thing BRB. is is like uh, everybody. For them, they're like, I'm on fucking vacation. I'm ready to get like wild. For us, it's like, uh, yeah. we gotta work. Like we're technically working. I mean, the event was super fun, but it's still like, it's still work. It was still work, but I, I, I had so much fun. Oh, I had so like, much fun, was, but I was like, yeah, I, like setting up and stuff. I wish I would have prepared a little bit more in terms of just like getting more sleep ahead of time. How's that you gonna know? work? I just, you know, I, I probably would have lasted like a little. I probably wouldn't have passed out on the couch as quick that day. Yeah, yeah. You, what? Uh, yeah. What I, I did. I, was, I regret that because you guys were by the fire pit, and that's like the one thing I wanted to do. <laughs> I ordered <laughs> that a bunch of uh, five thirty. Yeah. Back. yeah, I ordered a bunch of hydration stuff to get ready. Yeah. So like, I had I a bunch too. of hydration tablets and like, like Pedialyte like Gatorades. Uh, I did something else. Like, it's what I got when we went like hiking, like up in the mountains. And I was just I like, I got a bunch of that shit. Liquid IV. Yeah, I, I I drank like three of those. Uh, the drinking day was like Saturday, right? So I drank like we're going, every we're going day order. was the drinking day. I, I know we're going. Okay, I'll save it. So <laughs> liquid IV. Friday, name list. Name list. Name this is who we all got to meet. I'm just gonna pass it down. I'm gonna do like a handful and pass it. Uh, Siege, Manny D. Fucking Geo, uh, AJ, Obed, JJ, Ryan of New York, Tamir, aka Bracteer. We got, and don't do last names. Tamir's we got, girl. We got Joe, we got Cameron, we got Jess. Tim, we got Odie, we got Jess, we got Jess, we got Ellie, we got Lucia, we got Puppy. Her name is Lucy. 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 I know, but I, I we got, we got, we got Maria, Joey, Terry. John, no, we, didn't Whoa, get no we, we didn't meet we didn't anybody. Get no named Terry, Terry, no John, bro. We didn't meet no new. Okay, no, we no didn't. Terry, no, John. no, no, okay. We met, everybody, we met yeah. a Johnny and we met a watchdog. Whoa, okay. We we met Neil, Adrian, and we did not meet Chivalry Thomas. So we did not. <laughs> okay, it's a funny it's name though. Literally, the Chivalry it's threat. Not, that's not what I just. I purposely said it wrong. <laughs> uh, Nathan, Nate, Nate the baritone. That guy literally sang opera. Chelsea Adams, mm-hmm. Steven, yeah. Yeah. Fahad. Fahad did a cosplay as me. We'll talk more on that oh later. Oh my god, that, that was, was really, really fun. Lavelle, Kaylin, Lovey, Anna, Nathan, just uh, Jess, uh, brought to you as Jess. Jessica. There's a Jess and a Jessica. The homie Brando, who graduated from the same high school as me, crazy, 11 years later, and Michael Oregon, of course. Hey. Um, oh yeah, Brando. Yeah, he was, that, yeah, he guys, was really cool. He was I think, really cool. I think that's, I that's, think that's everybody. Back. That well, was, uh, uh, yeah, we just fun. wanted to give a shout out specifically to all the names. We have stories with each of you from the weekend. Things got crazy. Things were amazingly fun. And it was like uh, someone described it in Discord as 72 hours of being in a different world. And they were having trouble adjusting back to reality <laughs> when <laughs> coming back to work on Monday and like continuing with the week. I'm like, that. that's great to hear as like people like we've been to festivals and had like these that's experiences as well. Yeah. But like that is that is how I, I share the same sentiment. Like I felt like a kid at recess for three days, yeah. four or five days. Really, I want the dunk tank for longer next year. Uh, yeah, it, one of yeah. my Friday highlights was meeting Kia. One <laughs> yeah. because our, our thumbnail it, guy. It put things into perspective. Kia is our thumbnail guy. If you've seen our thumbnails or thumbnails, Kia was watching us back before I was even on the channel. Back when you guys were in the bedroom, he was like sixteen in high school, right? So he was watching these YouTubers. He became a part of our community. He shit talked and bullied us. 
<laughs> he called you Kinder Egg. He shit talked and bullied me. <laughs> really? Until he would just say Chris is a Kinder Egg because I mispronounced his name like a handful of times. He did we, that. We thought Kia was a girl for love. We were like yeah. Kaya. Yeah, oh, hey, yeah. Kaya. Kaya. And he was like, no, it's Kia. But like we had already said it in our minds, and it took me a really long time to get used to it. And then um, we fucking hired him, and he was like, your thumbnails are kind of ass, real talk. Like I could probably do better. Did better. It was like, damn, he's on top of it. Hired this dude, and then like all of that, like. Straight up, like six years later, finally get to meet him, and I was just assuming Key was gonna be like this, like yeah, like, yeah, yeah, little yeah. short, like fucking... four and a half foot. This motherfucker's like six foot tall and shit, wavy <laughs> ass hair. I was like, God damn, Key, I was it. I thought you're gonna be a little chibi ass motherfucker. You're out here making moves. Dude, <laughs> he reminds me of Argyle somewhat. Yeah. Right? <laughs> his, his, his jewelry drip is on point. Like right? we, we we were sitting at uh, at the table, and he was like getting ready for the day, and he just pours out like a bag of jewels. It looked like he just came back from a heist, and he was just. <laughs> <laughs> just, <laughs> I gotta yeah, get like the his, his rings and bracelets and all. Yeah, yeah um, it was uh, so Friday, a really good day. Um, kind of took it easy. Do? Yeah, it was just like meet and greet, meet and games, 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 and games. Um, got oh, out of our there. Mac and cheese. Well, all the food, all the fucking vendors fucked us. Essentially, almost all of them. Mm -hmm. We had a place called Mac and Cheese on Friday night that was supposed to. Uh, uh, cater the mac and cheese, but they they forgot the and cheese part <laughs> of their name. They they called us the hours before saying like, yeah, we we, we ran out of cheese. We don't have cheese, <laughs> and we confirmed it months in advance. The same week, we confirmed it at the beginning of the week. We good, we good. And then what happened? They asked to. They uh, oh, uh, Ronald was like, I need to speak to the manager. And they're like, well, funny thing, the manager's being fired on Sunday. <laughs> we all I suspect it's because cheese. he forgot to order cheese. I don't. I still like. I don't know because there, there was. So many cancellations that I feel like people were just lying to us. I, I that's that's what it feels like. Even our security canceled, dude. That was like that was the gut punch for me. I was like, mother. Like, we're a what? professional security company. Uh, we're well, gonna be there, he, the, but the, no. the, the the guard got COVID. But I'm like, why wouldn't you have a backup? Right exactly. Like, like why you're. They got one guard. I I, I I vouch for this company too, man. They had a really good rating with the BBB. <laughs> Look, like, I mean, Sheesh. he got he got COVID though. So yeah, like, I he, can't blame can't. him, but I'm blaming the company. Like like. No, you definitely should. You you have a you have a high rating with the BBB. You don't have like you know like I I just. Figure. I mean, it's, it, prob it's probably the employment shortage. Right, you have someone else on retainer. That's like, yeah. We got to bring in the ringer. Yeah, it's that's like what I'm a, saying. Like you got to have a backup, there's especially under, for something as staff issues. Something everywhere. as important as security. I was really mad about that. One. Yeah, and it's, it, it doesn't. Your vouching is cool because you vouch, but how the fuck would you have known? You did Exa a little bit exactly. of research. You're and I, I'm trying to be lenient because yeah, like people are understaffed and stuff too so maybe mac and cheese maybe that manager was overworked and he forgot yeah. the, I, there was the title was, of the restaurant there was one, <laughs> there was one too many because we weren't like out in the middle of nowhere like we were in carmel like no we were in westfield we were kind of out it in the was middle out. Of but, westfield was nice. but, but there was a minor just because westfield's a, nice doesn't mean it's okay, not okay, the middle okay. of nowhere but we weren't though there was like a myers in the shopping center right there so we we're like close to civilization you know what i mean like I it was just one too many cancellations for me to believe that it was all like or game. What, do you, what do you think is a conspiracy? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Shut yeah. down the normal. Listen, <laughs> yes. Listen. Yes, because what even, if? even the pizza canceled the next day, or something else canceled. The pizza the next yeah. canceled. Yeah, so so they must. And have the been firefighters like, didn't I show up. I bet you, dude. They're yeah. like, how many pizza? Like twenty five pizzas. That's fucking money for them, though. Uh, Look, not, not here's for, the only reason why I disagree. The, for, the, for the people that own the place, but maybe it was some shithead kid working well, like. I'm fine, I'm well, here's, that. like here's the only reason why I disagree that Westfield's not the middle of nowhere. It's not. Listen, Indianapolis is the city. Carmel is the suburbs. Westfield is on the other side of the suburbs. Which is not a suburb. I, okay, I consider middle of nowhere to where you have to drive 10 minutes to the nearest plaza or anything like to do. Ah. There was a, there was a Meyer, There's a Meyer and a Walmart in every town. Yeah, if I pull there, off there, anywhere. There was, a, there was a Portillo's right there too, man. It was like There was a Portillo's. There was yeah. a Portillo's. It was super Westfield cool. far as far. <laughs> Y'all say that if you want to, all right? I'm just going to tell you from so, my personal opinion, it Westfield. Was, it was super close. Anywhere outside of Westfield, <laughs> you're just in no man's land until so, you get to the next can, suburb. Can we describe if you weren't at Normicon, it was a barn venue style. <laughs> Open Airbnb. barn slash yardage for us to use for the with carnival a pond. shit. Don't forget with the pond. pond. Yeah, it was a nice hole. area. There was it was hot as a bitch. It was hot as fuck. It was supposed to rain. It ended up being ninety. There was so much land we didn't really even use all of it. Like there was a whole ass soccer field that I, I can't believe yeah. nobody played soccer. Uh, yeah, we wanted to. We wanted to. We and then if you kept going, there. there was like a pl walk through the woods, and then a whole nother field opened up. Yeah. Like it was insane. Mm. 
beautiful. We, we've mm. stayed in the barn most of the time. Yeah. Played. Uh, what were the most popular games? Cool. Cool. Secret Hitler. Secret Hitler. We, so we need three copies of Secret Hitler next time. And we need oh, three copies of Coup. the Dune game we played with uh, Adrian was really fun too. I really. It was. Once, yeah. once I, found, I was. It was shit hung over that at that during that description <laughs> period, but once we started going, it was good. Yeah. Yeah. We also had ping pong. Yeah. Well, high is pretty good, you know, at serving. Oh, he's one of the best uh, servers I've seen. Serving him up. Yep. And then I got, I, I, I gotta say, Caitlin was great. At oh yeah, she was good. She she whooped me, but but I beat Puffy and Ryan. I didn't beat them. I waxed that ass. <laughs> And cornhole? And corn. I was. Oh, yeah. uh, You're from Indiana. You better be good at but cornhole. I just, I just recently learned how to really play. It's in your bones, bro. Did you yeah. You've been in Indiana for 10 years. And the cornhole. And oh, the cornhole. God. And they have to reapply the total wax, too, because like they wanted to rematch the second day. So you mm-hmm. got up all, all up in there. All up in there. All up in that cornhole. <laughs> just, just, and probably, if you want to show, this, show it off, show the nicely waxed ass, go ahead and show it I would rather show off the cornhole. <laughs> yeah, it's waxed. Uh, so I guess we're on a Saturday. <laughs> Uh, we had a good old... I wasn't ready for uh, karaoke. Karaoke was kind of wild because it, everyone... All, yeah, everyone did a oh, song. Wait, what about the During the Day Carnival stuff? Oh, oh yeah, my bad, my bad. Uh, the dunk tank. Yeah. The gross-ass dunk tank. Let's talk about the obstacle <laughs> course because that was awesome. That was yeah, fun. Yeah, the obstacle course. It was really fun. It was really, like... It's surprisingly taxing on the stamina. That thing you chew you up and spit you out. Yeah, yeah, you like, oh, I have all the energy of an adult now. I don't know how and then when you're over there, you're like... How am I gonna go on living? It wasn't. Like, <laughs> I, I could have gone through it through it faster, but like the floor would like sink and you would just fall. And then yeah, it was just I touched, like hard I touched to, ground a couple of times. It was just hard to get back up. I don't yeah. know how Geo did it in the cow costume. Oh, there was I also Geo in a cow costume. And then run a buster a lit. Yeah. Oh yeah. I don't know how man. She's always getting injured bro. because she went up against Nikki for the crown of queen of the normies, and she, and, but she, she, she absolutely she, smoked Nikki. She smoked. Like, she didn't seem to go she, that hard. She smoked. Like, she must have like just barreled her body through like several she, of the obstacles. Uh, oh, there was a foot race. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I, I would have. Oh, if I would have competed in that, I would have won that. I don't know. I, there was a foot race. This this. I, Chris, he didn't even tell us, bro. Chris, us. no, Chris, you were one different special specimen out there. I don't even know how to describe you. Like they should take your DNA and put in test tubes. Oh God! And because <laughs> oh, you're special, oh, being like, that. look how big this man is. All right, I'm, all right, look I'm how big he is. <laughs> I, and this man be a guy with GQ abs in a race. I'm just saying. Them abs don't help him run faster. I'm you know just how saying. Much he, bites? he runs with his dog all the you're, time. You're, uh, yeah. what, you're, you're Ida. Yeah, yeah that's yeah, why I'm likes you so much. You know, you know, keep those Ida legs on deck. I barely won. I literally won by like one step. Like I, thought, I looked over, I was like, "Fuck!" Why, why, why do you call that a foot race? That's just a race. I when when a foot race, I thought you were talking about like when you tie your. foot That's a three legged race, Brett. A foot race is like that's what you call it. No, you just call it a race. Like what? There's so many different kinds of races. Yeah. I know, but like, <laughs> you want a race? Like cars, cars, or like a foot race, bikes. I mean, tricycles, con- roller skates. Context matters. I, I guess for them you have to specify. But I was like, yeah. I don't. I've never heard it called foot race. It's the one thing. It's called. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's that's pretty commonly referred to. It's like, it's just like, it's, it's Do always, you think all ball games are handball? So if anyone says they're playing handball, you're just like, why are you calling no, basketball that's, handball? That's different. Those okay. are different sports. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, what we had the dunk tank, which had all of our ass soup mm-hmm. just boiling up in there. It felt great because it was cold water. Look, Chris went first. Thank God. Mickey. It was all the sweat and like the sunblock people were wearing. You know? Yeah. It was Pat's Axe body spray. Yeah. I mean, hey, Bleaching. Hey, man, I, I said we should have saved the water and try to sell it. No, we did save it. <laughs> we we saved got the some. bottle. We're, We're saving it. Yeah. Shut if up. you guys want to buy Normicon exclusive yeah. muck water, 10, we got it. $10,000. It, it has a little bit of Chris. Pat, me, Mickey, Navi, uh, some of the attendees mm-hmm. went in there. Geo like went in there. Suit. Yeah, um, you could have dunked the mod, our mod administrator, Geo. Yep. You know how much you guys hated when he mods oh, you. Geo you could have dunked him. Oh, Geo got me. Yeah, Geo got yep, he got me good. <laughs> he was waiting um, for that one. The dunk tank was surprisingly fun. I'm glad I went first. It was very cold. Oh, sorry. I just can, can I just say one thing. No, the fire department canceled on us. They were supposed to come fill the dunk tank. Yeah, they're like, well, no problem. We're gonna come, and it'll be it'll take us five minutes with our hose. I'm uh, like, okay. Okay, so we're in like the super nice part of town. So apparently, the fire department was closed. But <laughs> what? 
Yeah, because like Shelby went over there and they were like, yeah, they were closed. I was like, that's not how. How are you close a fire department? What we should have done was start a fire in the dunk tank. <laughs> and be like, hey, we got a fire yeah, on our property. Can you come put it like out? They were calling them. Nobody was answering. I was like, are they for real? Like, just call nine one one or ask the fire department. Fire department. You can't call nine one one unless it's an emergency. There. You can't. That's not an emergency. They're oh my just, god! Gonna take the, a fire our off. dump tanks taking an hour to fill up <laughs> at the regular hose. I don't want to derail, but if there's time, I want to talk about it at the end. I called a non-emergency for two crackheads outside my house today, but that's, <laughs> that's neither here nor there. <laughs> um. Well. Oh yeah. Karaoke. Karaoke. So wait, moving on now. The carnival stuff is over. We didn't even get to do the sumo suits. No. The carnival stuff is over. Oh, and now, we did the tie dye. Yeah, we didn't do sumo suits. I forgot it's it was, way too fucking hot. Way too I forgot hot. we even had yeah. those. Heat stroke. Just absolutely <laughs> yeah. heat stroke. Yeah. Uh, we got hot box <laughs> pizza. Couldn't. And then we, we had a five hour break. It felt like a two hour break. Yeah. That's because some of y'all did. I went I, home I, and sl- I literally laid in the bed. I wish I would have done my I took all of my so clothes off except for my drawers home. and just like face down. Just like, <sighs> I should have went home. That's what I, I should have done. Nah, man, because I spent so much on gas. Like it, the venue was like 40 minutes yeah. away from my house. And it was like, so I was going to leave. 40 minutes away from downtown. It was 40 minutes from my parents' house and my nowhere. house. So it didn't even matter. Like if I like I couldn't use them as like a midpoint because it was like. I could have crashed my parents' place. It was like 15 minutes away, bro. Oh, Don't yeah. believe in it. Well. I that's where, that's where I, I went, but I did not sleep. I, I got to shower all the nasty ass <laughs> uh, drunk dunk tank water off of the sweat from two days. Drunk tank, dunk tank, it's all about the same. Look, man, that it was, was, so it was a drunk tank. We were revitalized. I was doing my best to not drink until we came back anyway. So, one, we had a bartender and we had that Vecna so cool. shots. You guys remember the Vecna shots? It, yeah. The Chrissy. That was fun. There was a Chrissy wake up shot and then there was an orderly number one. I made these. I won't tell you guys the secret ingredients, but if you want to know about them, you can just ask me. It's Malort. Malort. <laughs> it's just and malort. red food dye number five. Malort. <laughs> it's just malort. It, uh, everybody surprisingly wanted a lot of them. Yeah, yeah. Well, I probably doled up. I think we killed like both, uh, like half of each That's bottle. Disgusting. So technically, one bottle. Yeah, anyone one. actually like it? Yes, one there was, was one done. person that genuinely liked it. They were like, "Yeah, I was a little bitter afterwards, but in like a good way." I was like, "You're, I don't, I don't need to talk to you." <laughs> <laughs> That's how Hannah was. I Hannah threw, she was, was like, she fucked with my lord. She's like, really? she's yeah. Hey, Some people Hannah, like it. So. All the other drinks we had, we had uh, Titan Serum, Titan serum mm-hmm. and the injection. We had Temp V, uh, Compound V. Oh, the and then the most popular one was Indiana Smash, bro. That, the ha- yeah. the for, Halloween one? I mean, the Jalapeno one? Yeah, but the My Hero Academia one. The Indiana Smash was, like, the most yeah. popular one. And you could tell, like, Hannah was getting a little slosh, too. She was just like, I've just been seeing if, if like, it's tasting right. I'm sorry. That's what Mark is supposed to do. She still ended up making, like, great drink. No one complained about anything. And, like, she did a fantastic job. Like, yeah. It was fun partying with Hannah and Shelby, too. Because like, yeah. we, had, we hadn't gotten a chance to, like, do mm-hmm. that with them. Oh, yeah. I've partied with Hannah a bunch. She'd be at the apartment. So She's Sydney's yeah. friend. Yeah. So, but, um... Karaoke, uh, a lot of people sing. We have a lot of really good singers. We have a music yeah. teacher. We got Chelsea, who's just on a whole other fucking level with Opera. singing. Uh, Manny came in there with some bars for some uh, Hamilton stuff. Bars. Uh, uh, it was Manny, Nathan. Chelsea, and Maria did yeah. all three of the Schuyler sisters, uh, Schuyler sisters, and they did Satisfied. It was fucking great. They all did their part. And uh, Nathan the Baritone, yes. who was an opera singer, oh my did God. Take On Me, oh. but the opera version. That was crazy. Which was a little ridiculous. Take Ready? On me. I'll be on in a day off. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry yeah. about your ears. Yeah, yeah, like that, but doesn't that good. hurt you guys' still when you go that? Nah, man, you gotta not rock that falsetto, bro. Yeah. They don't I call me the throat goat for nothing. Just oh, kidding. God. Throat throat goat. Goat. We did a we did a seven person duet. <laughs> yeah, Mickey. All right, so look, I feel the actual frustration of being like the karaoke dude. I've never done it before, fully. Mickey comes up and he's like, "Look, I want to do um, we're we're doing a Backstreet Boys song." I was like, "Okay." He was like, "I need uh, how many mics you got?" I was like, two. And he's like, "There's gonna be seven of us." I was like, well, you can't rub the mics well, together, and make it multiply, bro. Where no, you no, are? You no, no, these no. Two. Well, I think I think what ended up happening because I didn't know other people were doing that song, and then I find out that like the. I think just a bunch of people just chose that song. It's a good karaoke song. We, uh, yeah. So we were like, fuck it, let's just choir this bad boy. Did uh, Kaylin do the Aladdin song? Da da da. Yeah. Does anyone have any tiny feels? 
anyone have a recording of all the guys and all the oh, yeah. we were like we were like dancing on the side well that's the thing <laughs> is that uh also to go along with everything else uh spencer our guy who usually runs our podcast and all this was gonna be there filming but he also got COVID right yeah. beforehand so bit, so you had to be there to see we were it. just lo- like left and right then like spencer's like i can't come fuck fire department's like eat a dick just like fuck mac and cheese people are like we don't exist anymore just like come on and yet despite all the problems it didn't really phase it's us. our third one huh it's our third one we're yeah. good at this now we know what we're, we're fucking loosey goosey we're good with water like, man like, we flow in like, like, like nobody was as stressed as i feel like we would have been like if it was like not I mean, because maybe like, runner probably took the most brunt of it well i'm sure people, i'm sure she was actually pretty stressed but like it was just cool like we handled it well it was, it was yeah, we, yeah we, i will we, say run it run out quarterback a lot of that and she was t- getting the different food vendor shout yeah. out to shelby uh, hannah and pizza. uh yeah. dameron too dameron uh, yeah old da handling oh also ice was on shorthand um so here's the last part of the night we fucking oh. drank <laughs> well <laughs> fucked up there was a one point in time, there's a video of me doing a keg stand, which had to be easily. Oh yeah, I helped you get up out to do a keg stand. The worst idea, but also that had to be at like already 3 a.m. Yeah, if you're doing a keg stand at 3 a.m. <laughs> and remember, Mark these these are not regular keg stands; these are the mini keg stands, so you hardly have any yeah. leverage. It yeah. was it was like four or four thirty. Oh god, dude, I, uh, Shelby did her first. Yo, keg stand. yeah, okay, I, I did it. I, I got to do a keg stand; it was cool, but like whoever was doing the beer part, like they didn't, they, they were just like spraying my shit. <laughs> yeah. like, Oh, and God. I was just like, <laughs> <laughs> the video of somebody like, <laughs> like a fish. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, listen. No names. I was getting like waterboarded with beer, man. No names, but we dropped somebody. And that's when. <laughs> Who got dropped? Who got dropped? No, no names. I'm not saying it. No names. Is it? Sh- no, 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 no. Was no, it me? No, me? no I, I just. I'm not going to say the name. Is it somebody that I works here? I think it was only three people that did it. Is it somebody that works here? Can't say. I'll tell you guys after on camera because I don't want to embarrass anybody. But we dropped somebody. And at that moment, I looked at their face and said, oh, they're fucked up. And then I thought to myself, yeah, but you were just holding this person. I was like, oh, I'm fucked up. Like, I'm going to stop drinking. And I made like the conscious decision. Keg stands were a bad idea. And well, then I had like maybe between the hours of four and five, I had like two or three like in-depth conversations with people. And I remember being like, we're having a really good conversation. And I know that we're having a conversation. I will not remember the substance of this conversation. <laughs> yeah. I am sorry. Uh, yeah, I had, everything I had from those. like I so I had to be reminded that the keg stand happened. Like I, I browned out. What do they call it? Like, like yeah. remember the keg stand? I was like, well, now I do. Shit. Well, yeah. Otherwise, like that, I never would have thought of it. The fire pit, everything to the fire pit. I forgot about that. The video of me on you on the couch. Yeah, did you yeah. forgot about he, that. He assaulted me. Chelsea yeah. on the show. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Just tell him you're kidding. Uh, Marquette <laughs> said that you came into the room. It was like. Is anybody sleeping in here? She was just like, I am. Okay. I was slamming the door and it waltzed off. Like, where were you? I did that. Yeah. I did that. She said you came in as loud as possible. Just screamed. Is anyone sleeping? <laughs> yes. I'm sorry. So, I just don't remember like the conversations. I remember the people I talked to, but then the last I remember I was like trying to like we were all around the fire pit. I was like, I'm gonna start a fire, and then my brain was like, Hey, you're starting a fire. I don't know how you gotta you sober do. up. Well, I uh, do the fires for the sauna. So yeah. like, I made my little TP. I found some tinder around. I just kept going at it, and I finally got it going. And I was like, and I sat back, and I was like. Damn, bro, you started a fire. Hell yeah. And I was like, oh, shit, I'm sobered up a little bit. I was like, good. And I look around. Everyone was like sitting around a fire. The homie Nate was sitting next to me. He was still dressed as Spider-Man and shit. And I was like, <laughs> oh, Nate. Yeah, man. And then I just looked over and I, once again, no names. I see two people holding hands. And I was like, damn, this is awesome, bro. Look at this Norby Kai. I, I and I looked around. I was like, yeah, I'm up till five. Yeah. Like, I'm all the way. I'm all the way up until five. I never stay up that late. I'm like, man. I did it, man. I fucked up. And then I, I wandered up. off to go I to fucked up. up. I don't remember much, I but I remember up. that. I was like, ah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's what's up. Good shit. <laughs> yeah, man. It was, um. No, Kurt and Mickey, I'm sorry. I don't know me. I was just on the couch. Look, back in the day, <laughs> oh, when I was we used like, to like. I was saying it jokingly. I know you but. were. But just to preface, when we used to drink in college and go to parties and stuff, I don't know if this is we popular. Were, it was like bromosexual. We were bromosexual. You know, bro, bromosexuality. We just yeah, like. You got to experiment with your top of sexuality. Of, I just got on top of Mickey for a bit. <laughs> he was like. Hold pinky sometimes. You were passed out. I was trying to get you to get up. I, I, I know. You were, you were trying to do the right thing. And I. I you were like, no means no. No means no. <laughs> no, means no. <laughs> 
I was just like slow. I was giving you a little tease. <laughs> yeah. little tease. Mickey, I love you. You know it, but you've got the least tolerance of everybody. I love it. No. I love it I when you get drunk. Know. You're always just like, no. I'm not drunk. It's like, I, t- I've been trying to tell you. You said you got I, more tolerance than me. I've been trying to tell you. I just said I have more tolerance than you. I'm just saying, out of everybody <laughs> on the Normies crew. Did I? Yes, no, I didn't. The yes, only person did. who probably has a lower tolerance than you is Rena. <laughs> and, and both of you are the type of people that's like I'm not drunk and it's like you are violent you look like the poster of a drunk person like a parent has a picture of you in their house and says if your but kid like, looks like this they're drunk okay, no, no, to be, no, no, every, every time we think I'm drunk I'm just like giggling I'm just, I'm just like giggling <laughs> you're like always two I'm drinks just, away just, from being done I'm just, I'm just loosey goosey that's not drunk yeah I, you are and, and that threshold is like a beer yeah. length you're like, like a like, beer to two beers away from being absolutely <laughs> done you're just like like when we were at the uh, when we were at a snake pit I was like hell yeah I was like Mickey's feeling it I looked up he's like I'm good and then Obit was like and I was like Obit are you good bro I was like I'm good I was like alright about two beers later you're just uh, uh, well, because, was, so, because Chris, it was hot you have not seen the video of Mickey and Cabo at the uh, what was that club called the Mandela 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 <laughs> Like he's still bless his heart. He's still awake, but he's so tired. We're out there like no, three. No, I wasn't tired. I was I was trying not to throw up. <laughs> okay. so you were like you were just like <laughs> I was like yeah, I was breathing. I was just like doing breathing exercises for like an hour. Oh <laughs> my god! Yeah. He, he was like dead, but still like <laughs> go yeah, lay down. I was like, I couldn't. We were like in it, like yeah. on the dance floor. Yeah. I, I, I was just I, like. I, I have a story of Mickey if you don't want me to shower. I don't think anybody knows this story. Remember that when we went to Vegas? The Vegas for Vima. We had that one drunk night. I want to hear this story. I mean, and yes. then we're back to the con, but I oh really want to hear this story. We were just meaning we were just joining the town. I just and we don't were, remember what happened. Okay, it wasn't bad. Yeah, I'm just saying. Yeah, yeah. Tell, so we 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 we, <laughs> we, 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 we all, right, all right. So we, we were in Vegas. It was into the mic, pet. Into so the mic. So we ran to some hookers. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> we went, we went there for a convention. You know, VMO. We got you know we got sucked into that shit. We were uh, we were MLM boys. That'll be, yeah. that'll be another podcast one day. Um. So we were in Vegas, and we were like, all right. So last night in Vegas, we really didn't get a chance to party because like we were there for the con, and on like we were also like at that time like not, we didn't have that much money, so I like, kind of broke. So we didn't like want to do too much. So we ended up like getting a bottle and we're like, let's go check out the town. We'll see if whatever we get into, we'll get into. Um, but before we could get into anything else, like we were like pre-gaming and we had Goldschlager. Um, what are you, six? Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah so uh-huh. we had well, Goldschlager. was the drink of choice back then. Yeah, back, you know, just to get fucked <laughs> up really quickly and let's go. So we were like, we we're, right, we're pre-gaming and then we're trying to go, we're trying to find something to get into. Um, but we could never get something to get into. This man was like already drunk. On the train, like on like the subway, yeah. And then we're like, we got to get back, and like, he, he, yeah, we never got into get anything, but like, it was just like the conversations like this man had, were like we were having, it was like hilarious. Like he was just drunk. What? I, Damn, you didn't even make it past the pregame phase. <laughs> Listen, it, it was, was gold slugger. It was gold slugger. We we used to buy it saying like you know the gold flakes cut your throat. Cut your throat and they make you a little more drunk. You make it drunk faster. I'm like wait, why did we want that? <laughs> like, like we wanted to cause injury. Can, can I tell one more quick Mickey drunk story? Sure. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Well, I'll allow it. I don't. Okay, I remember. Wait, hold on. But was there any specific thing I said that night? Like what? I was trying. To, it was. I, I just remember I've never seen you drunk before, and that's my first time seeing you that drunk, drunk at the pregame. Right. Yeah. Okay. I was. Going to back to Miami Ultra when you had to pee really bad. Oh, yes. Oh, we had to yes. Oh, man. Use the trains. Yeah. You were just, Look, I, you were like, <laughs> he had to pee this bad that we were on the train going back to Pats. He was like, ah, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, like, stop it. You're like Dude. stopping us. He actually <laughs> just got out of the train. He just left. Yeah, he got up yeah, at a random time. I, okay, I can't. I can't. I can't. Look, and, and you know what the worst part was? Okay, so the, so the train, like, sometimes it's low to the ground. So when you get off, like, you only have to go one set yeah. of stairs down. And sometimes it climbs, right? Yeah. So, like, I recognize, like, okay, we're close by. I'm going to go pee. I can walk from here. Like, I got it. They were all freaking out. But I was like, I got this. I, 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 can, I can walk from here. So I go down there. And I expect to go down to the ground and find a bush. Dude, it was on an elevated thing, and it was like four stories. And you were afraid of heights. I, well, I was I was feeling good at this point, so I was I was I had to pee more than I was afraid of heights. Like, okay, that's how bad it was. So like I'm I'm walking down the stairs, and the stairs keep going, and I was like, "Fuck it, I'm pissing in the stairwell," and I did it, and it was it was. That that it was like a like I remember that piss. It was like it was a, one a, was a Belgian like, fountain. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, was uh, like, it was like a water jet, man, and it was like this is kind of gross, but it was like cold, so it was like steaming a little bit. Just cutting a hole into the concrete, Jesus. 
Good lord. Well, you know what? <laughs> I wanted to oh, pee dude, outside I, at Normicon. Was, man, that was a good one. Speaking <laughs> of water sports, that brings us to Sunday yeah. at Normicon. Water uh, sports. Well, what, everyone, what, 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 I was hungover as shit. That was fun. I was on my hydration shit. Surprisingly not hungover. I was, yeah, I wasn't really I should. I have those too. I should have brought them. I was going hard. I was damn near <laughs> popping the tablet straight into my guts. The water day was, uh, I think, probably one of the highlights. Yeah. One of the top so three fun. highlights. Just because it, 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 that is specifically when I felt like a kid again. Yep. Because I don't remember the last time We're I played with it, you know? water balloons and squirt guns. Why and just like we? People were doing everything. Chelsea had like dual cups of Kimbo. The, the people using people, the containers. Whole, People brought Tupperware. The hose was like the infinite ammo cheat. Yeah. Yeah. I went and got ice because I wanted to fight dirty. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Got the ice. I brought ice water. Oh, I thought you were like throwing ice at people. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Me and uh, Siege, we got like, because uh, we had to empty the coolers anyway because they were like, and I was like, oh, well, this ice water will feel great on everybody. I just, I and wanted did. to take a break. So me and JJ went to go like, take a break, you know? <laughs> and I was like, okay, I gotta go to the house. Let's just go to my car. I'm just walking. I'm like hung over a shit. And like, I didn't know that like, the grass is like foreign, is like non sovereign territory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> as soon as you touch the grass yep, by there, it's like it's that's, you're consenting you consent. to be sprayed. <laughs> like they were just like looking at me, like, Serge, where's your phone? Where's your phone? I was like, in, my, in my pocket. It's like, get rid of it. Like, what, 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 what's happening? What's happening? And then, like, I don't know, someone came. Ellie was like, here, give me your phone. And I was like, okay. And then watch, <laughs> Watchdog grabbed me, and I was like, ah! <laughs> just pelting me, and they threw me in the tub. And I was like, that's okay. I think I, I needed that. It helped wake me up. And yeah. It helped. It helped. It, it I'm was telling great. you, man, next year, do the, do the, the like, the liquid IV or whatever Christmas. Yeah. Day. Also, next year, I think, uh, but super I will, soakers. I'm about to say, I'm going to start stocking up on super, super soakers yep. just for, like, an actual water war. Yep. Yeah. We need way balloons. more balloons next year. We need, like, 2,000 balloons next year. Catapults and shit. Um, <laughs> we went through 500 balloons Trend in, like, 10, That would be kind of cool minutes. if we made some kind of game out of it, you know? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. We could gamify it, because I definitely had Team a shit ton of fun, and after we gamified we could just soak each other. There was a there was a drying area. We played with the frisbee a bit. We did it. I didn't like there. that drying area at all. Pat, you didn't like it because you wanted to get people that in the was, dry area wet. It was sovereign nation. It but was no, sovereign land. listen, it's a water day. You dry off when it's done. If we were done. You no, dry we off when done. you're we done. Still- Man, my, my shoes were wet. I had to like. Throw them over there at the dry area because oh, people man. kept going. Yeah, over. <laughs> dude, I, I I forgot to take my shoes off before I went there, and that was, that was the worst thing I did. <laughs> yeah, I, foolish. That was foolish. There's yeah. rules of engagement though, and more. Uh, I, I don't like I don't like the safety zone. No, if you go up to someone <laughs> and say war. pants or shirt, and they answer, that's consent. That's consent. Or, or <laughs> pants or, or shirt. Like which one? I'm gonna you, spray you. Pants or shirt. Like Ryan came by and he he had balloons. He's like, I'm not he ready yet. I'm not ready on. yet. I was like. Well, Pants are shirt. Like you're you're on the grass. You have weapons. You, you're yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> you're a, you're a foreign combatant at this point. If you if you even reach for a water gun, that's consent. Like you're just, you're yeah. Just even. Oh, uh, we could do like a duel next time. Like put two water guns, like just fire and be like, <laughs> yeah. all right. Yeah. Um, there's plenty of. But that the water day was surprisingly fun. And then after that, we just kind of wind down, played games. Yeah. What if we did a protect the VIP? Two sides. You have to like take them over to the other. Keep that person completely dry. What's that uh, person has to be completely dry. Everyone else can get wet, but like, what's an outfit that shows water really well? Gray shirts, white shirts, Sorry, like no. a, a gray shirt. Yeah. Okay. What about like I'm, like an all gray outfit? So we're not gonna do a white t-shirt contest. Yeah. What if, I don't know. What if we could somehow get something like like paint or something? Like, paint like on um, face paint, and it has to like come off. Oh. So every go oh, while, everything, every, every, all shots are yeah. going to be at your face, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah that'd be bad. So I think, uh, not like a great shirt, like we could just see like who's the wettest, we could just look. Yeah. Um, or, or we like loosely stick some targets, you have to like knock them off with the water. Something like that, but yeah, I think a protective VIP would be fun. So I'm saying we could come up with a bunch you, of like you, water you, you themed games. You can tell when someone's wet, like you, you, you'll be able to tell. Can you? <laughs> you? You can tell who's drier. Ben yeah. Shapiro cannot. Uh, 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 uh. Ah. Yeah, um, <laughs> Topical. So the only worst part about Norman Connor is that it has to end. And as the people were trickling wah, out wah, one wah, by wah, one, wah, it felt wah. like to us that this was less of a normie con and more of a normie camp. And I think next time, normie camp. we might just go for the whole summer camp angle. We normie did do camp. tie-dye shirts. We did do a talent show. We did do cosplay. We it's did a, play board games. Can- no, we like- were 
at a camp, essentially. I like Normie Camp. I like Normie Camp. Yeah, I like Normie Camp. It was like a Normie camp, camp, right? Like, I like Normie Camp. I've never been to summer camp, but those kids who have been, they told us it was like a I camp. I've never been to summer camp either. Me neither, yeah, bro. Yeah, Normie Camp. They got a summer camp for adults <clears throat> where we could just drink. That'd be so fucking cool. There has to be like a time where we're like, all right, we are going to bed now. <laughs> this is going to be hard to like. <laughs> no, no, what we should do is <laughs> we should schedule it, though, and be like, look, some of us are going to be here for the, like, the after party is officially beginning now. And then be like, if you don't want to be a part of the after party, go back. you can go. Fucking safe. And we can, like there's just a just like there's a safe zone where people don't wet each other. There's a safe zone. Like Marquette even had up the idea. She was like, this should just be like a quiet area. If, just a, if you're in this area, you're not expected to talk or interact. If you're just here to chill, and then there's your I'm asleep area. That way we get those delineations because we do have a lot of quiet attendees at Normicon. Like um, some people who just want to kind of sit. Like a lot of people sit by the fire pit just for quiet moments, just to kind of calm down. We have a lot of introverts and extroverts. We got to make the time for them. And it was like, yeah, we get. Next time, just a little bit of delineation. That way, it, it, when you want to party, we, you party. We should lean all the way into the camp thing because there's like actual camp like sites where you can rent cabins. Yeah, and we're stuff. camp counselors. Yeah. And then we'll get Jason. Yeah, that's Boyd. all you have to but, say is we're camp counselors. But, 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 can, but can we pick a, a site where there's least amount of insects oh, and bugs and that's snakes? That's not how a least camp amount of works, incest, sir. Least <laughs> amount of incest. Uh, I love this idea because several of us thought of this like. Over the weekend, that was like the natural conclusion. Yeah, it, it felt like this was a bridge. We're like, ah, oh, we that is what we. Which do. is great because I was like, <laughs> how are we gonna top this Normie Con? Yeah, as yeah. soon as as soon as Saturday, like halfway through Saturday, I was like, fuck, this is great. Like, how are I was just thinking about the meetings we we're gonna have, and I was like, how the Despite fuck are we gonna figure this shit out? Like, how is this gonna ever get better? Like, this is kind of I was like this. I was like, fuck, what are we gonna do? And then Normie people started saying camp, and I was like, that's it. Normie camp. Normie Speaking camp, of some camp people and water sports. Idea, Normie like, camp 2023. Having, like bad betting. Like they still want like good. I feel you know, them. I feel them. 100%. Okay. Okay. Let's go somewhere nice. Nice. What? Okay. I, I think French Lake. French Lake. No, 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 no. I think I know a place. If you, if you go, keep going north on I-69, like past Hamilton uh, Town Center, like a little bit towards the Noblesville area, there's this area where there's like cabins that you can rent. It's like a camp. Oh, by the, by the, by the archery range. It's like an actual, yeah, camp. And then, like, that's still close enough to, like, uh, Hamilton Town Center so people could, like, still stay in hotels and stuff. So, like, okay, that. yeah. Yeah. Yeah, something like that. that. Happy just medium. having a meeting about next year now. Yeah, okay, yeah, you're just in this meeting. <laughs> yeah. uh, all in all, though, guys, the attendees, <clears throat> they had a, a beautiful time. I'm not going to name names, but I had, I believe I had a conversation with every single one of you. Uh, yeah. And a pretty solid one. We tried to, like cut the shit and just go deep into it either either we were talking about shows and fandoms and movies and the shit that we like and shit that we all have common ground on like one that makes it easier to talk especially with the introverts if we weren't talking about that then we were talking about like how great this was to like be with each other in person and to finally like put faces to names and for some people that are extreme introverts and some people that have suffered through like depression it really helped me to kind of talk to these guys that say like you guys have made me feel way more at home and welcome here to the point where like i feel like i can go out and start talking to people again or like i like am very alone in my in my regular life and here like now i i'm joining the discord i've met all the other people it's not just about meeting us it's about meeting mm -hmm. the whole community and then linking up and being friends with you know like i i, I try to talk to everybody as much as i can my Discord activity gets shittier throughout the year, but every NormieCon, like everyone's our best, everyone's our best friend, come and, may, and hang out, and then we create this like special bond that like well, only we went through all this. Like, well, we're, these are just stories. We don't have the videos and pictures to even tell you about shit. There's probably shit that we will never even remember that yeah. happened because yeah. we were at that point. Once but in it, a lifetime so experiences maybe, for everybody. Maybe we shouldn't try to like record it in an elaborate fashion. Maybe we should just have like minimal footage so it can be like a special. I know, I think it was just for us kind of a thing. little just a little yeah. highlight. We need yeah, a highlight. Just a tiny we're we're going we're gonna to try to put a little sizzle reel everything. together from like people's phones yeah. footage, but uh, our Google I Drive link is not be, working. Uh, so. Oh, we're going to figure it out. I think it's going to be actually kind of a vibe that way. I think it's going to feel really unique. I uh, like at the end of every summer for marching band, they always did these like marching band videos. They're super cheesy, but like Vibe. they're like, uh, what was the song? Brown and stand up here next to you. Like, you play these shitty ass like <clears throat> cheesy songs, but like with all the like footage, you're like, oh, that's right, we did that, we did that, we made memories, and I think. <laughs> It'll kind of have that vibe. I also saw two shooting stars Saturday night, and I was like, "Damn!" You man. did? Yeah. Oh, now come here and tell me, motherfucker. Well, I mean, I, I stayed out there looking. It, look, the, uh, there's a meteor shower that happens every time around this year, so don't worry. There's oh, more chances. Okay. You just gotta stay up late. Odie put together a really cool like thing on Instagram. Yeah. If you guys saw. Uh, uh, did you want to talk about your doppelganger? 
Oh, oh, we didn't talk about the cosplay contest on Saturday. Oh, cosplay oh that contest. was really good. Uh, Dang, so yeah, people really showed up for that one. Man. We had Johnny Johnny Blue came out as McLovin. He yeah. even had the license. That like was custom, brilliant. That was dope. Licenses. That deserved top three. But there were so many good ones. Corey was Cora. What was the top three? I believe number three was Black Loki. No, no, I think it Black was, Loki was number one. No, no, no. no. hold on, no, my bad. Spy yeah. X Family was number one. I think Eleanor right. was in top three. Right? Eleanor, Eleanor was, was number, number one. one. Spy X Family, Spy, uh, just Spy Family, Loki, Spy Family, and then uh, Surge. Yeah. Fahada oh, yeah. Surge. Oh, Fahada yeah. Surge That's was number right. three. Black Loki was number two. Eleanor was number that one. Was yeah, so someone great. cosplayed as me, and they did like a stand-up routine yeah. where they like were. <laughs> like, I don't know. I guess being savage on the other normies, that wasn't savage. It, it was, was like it was super like cheesy jokes. Yeah, it was hilarious. Like the market <laughs> substitute. So yeah. Like what? What jutsu can Mark? Uh, can Marketa not do in Naruto? It's like the substitution jutsu because it's not a market substitute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they were like super cheesy things. Here's what the funny part was. He dressed exactly like Surge yep. was dressed that day. Not planning it. Not planning it. He did not plan this. He didn't say, Surge, what are you wearing to NormieCon? Because that would be weird. We hadn't met Fahad before. Fahad was just like, I think I know what Surge is going to wear to NormieCon on this night. And he <laughs> fucking nailed it. <laughs> nailed it. It was like, to a T. Let me describe it. Wasn't it wasn't that simple. It was to a T. Button down. Was, no. Kaggy no. shorts on the Hawaiian Who button down. Have a button? <laughs> it was, That's it. It was. The only difference is Fahai like had on some dope Air Force too. Ones. It was like this floral pattern. The yeah. only difference was his shirt was red, yours was blue. That's the only yeah. difference. But it was the same pattern, same material. Like it was the. I, 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 I feel like he went into your closet. So. Yeah, <laughs> they literally look like it. Like I like, I like his his uh, Runa joke. He said like, where if Runa was in an anime, where would she be? <laughs> Jail. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh. <laughs> and then I can't I can't remember his. Oh, uh, he said um. Something what do you call my- what do you call a promiscuous leader of a village? A Hokage. Yeah. 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 yeah, they were they were some groaners, but there again, I was like, yeah, I could see. I could see. Anyway, like cosplaying a surge that 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 was a a boss move. Ha ha ha! It was pretty Ellie, fucking funny. Ellie one is the yeah spy family. yeah. I don't know the characters. Spy name. family. Uh, oh, girl from Spy Family. Uh, J- yeah, J- 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 Juro. You know, Jojo jo- jo- is a Jojo 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 Siwa. Jojo Siwa. Kuzo Biwa. Kuzo Biwa. So. I just think that a uh, few guys have the chance to come out to NormieCon next year that you should. Normie I actually camp. got a, oh my bad, Normie Camp. I got like three messages on Instagram. They're like, hey, bro, I live in Indy, big fan. Is it too late to come through to the con? I was like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. It's the middle of you, I'm like, hit you. I'm just like, yeah, bro, slide through. Like, come on, man. Like, <laughs> Send them the address anyway. We're con 24 7. So it's going to end up happening eventually, guys. And I, I hate to say it, but we love these types of intimate con experiences too much to let go and let like hundreds of people come Mm -hmm. to do like what we would have to do then is a meet and greet style traditional con where like there's lines for stuff so i think we're gonna cap it Mm -hmm. like this was the limit i think we could do like five more people maybe yeah Yeah. and that's the limit uh it was about 40 right yeah yeah i I double checked the list i think the list came out to around like 31 Oh yeah, I would say cap at forty-two. That's a nice number. Oh my god! And uh, if we capped at forty-two, that's enough normies to go around and split the time. Why don't don't we just cap at one hundred and eight? Too much. (laughs) (laughs) Well, how about how about this? We'll do the next one's forty-two, and then maybe after that we'll do a big one of like one hundred and eight, like classic concept. Then we can go back. Then we can go back to camp. (laughs) All right. So it'll be like so. Then we could do one on one off. It'll be like big con where it's like a regular con in a convention center type deal. And then like one on of just like. Con, camp, con, camp, con. That way we can, I don't know, maybe. We could try both. We haven't tried it that big before. You're entitled to your bottle of Normicon dunk water. <clears throat> oh, <that> was- <laughs> <laughs> it's like a lava lamp, but it's with dunk water. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh just heat it up. What is oh. that? It's just bacteria growing it's in just, there. It's just, that's hilarious. Uh, Gross. You know, I like I liked this chat just about Normicon. I don't really know. We need to talk about oh, it. Oh, no, no, I think we're about. actually here at the end. Yeah. We're at the end, and just like Normie kind of feels sad to end it. Mm-hmm. This is probably the last time we're going to get to properly relive and revisit these memories until we watch the video. Uh, we had a bunch of fun with you guys here on the podcast and also there at the con. Like, I know I'm not pushing for everybody to come to the con because you know everybody can't come. But if and you also, get the chance to definitely come through. It's still a risk, guys. You're still traveling in the airport. Um, there's germs around. People got COVID. Yeah. Uh, it's unfortunate. Some people got it for the first time, some people have mild symptoms. 
But um, well, there was also Gen Con. Um, yeah, there was, yeah. There was a big outbreak at Gen Con too, and we had so, some, we had some people staying in downtown. So I mean, even I, that just I, Indiana in general right now is kind of popping. Yeah, so, it's yeah. it's pretty popping because I feel like we did everything we possibly could. Yeah, we but were outdoors. It was unfortunate, is because uh, the air conditioning space is worse, right? Like, no. the, the the down currents is traveling and hitting everybody in the face. So we did what we could, and people knew the risks, and it sucks. But we're wishing them the best of recoveries and. Mm-hmm. Yeah, lots of rest. Drink lots lots, of, lots of hydration. Lots of hydration. It if it, if it yeah. gets bad, I mean, we'll get like a little game night on Discord like this weekend or something. Oh, we'll all hang oh that would out. be really fun. Yeah, yeah I'm down for that. Just do um, yeah, well, I think that brings us to the end of this podcast, which we were wondering what we were going to name it, but obviously it's just Normie Connor. Oh any Pat Ponders off the whim? Oh, yeah. Off the, off the whim related to anything we talked about? No, he anything? had one about a, a video uh, game. A video game idea. Is this going to be... <sighs> Just go for it, I guess. All right, all right. You oh, ready? Guys. Think, 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 think. Fucking big mirror. Think Marvel and think. You know, back in the big day, big mirror, big mirror, big mirror, black, black mirror. mirror, black mirror, black mirror. Black mirror. Right. Okay. <laughs> black mirror. <laughs> so what is big, big brother? Uh, black mirror uh, and Marvel. Marvel and then you know, back in the day, very, very, way back in the nineties, we had those little fuck. I never had because my mom. Tamagotchi. Tamagotchi. Yeah, you had to train a pet, and it was your pet. So it's all that merged together. So now we're in the futuristic time. And yeah, now okay. you get to choose a Marvel. You get to choose a Marvel. And like as like, as we grow like a character. Hero. Okay. Character. It could be a villain. It could be a, whatever you want to be. All right. And it's gonna be a little chibi. Very, very it's gonna be actually be able to, like it's gonna just come out. All right. They're living, breathing, like Bre- games. Yes. Okay. I mean, it's living, a bre- like Pokemon too, a little bit. Yes. But see, as as we grow up, we know that children is like what they call like the perception of their parents like they're like like you, you like when people say you're like the child is just the like apple doesn't fall far, far, far from, from the tree, tree. like oh, okay. you're, you're, okay. yeah, like yeah, you know yeah. what i mean you're just just like your dad you mm-hmm. are your dad so remember this child is just going to be just like you so if you're a shit person this child's going like this marvel person is going to be a shit person if you're a good person so like, let's say you get a superhero like captain marvel now you're trying to be a, like you're a good so obviously you're claiming you're because you could be a villain too and you could get a villain if you want to be. But let's say you get a Marvel guy like Captain America. All right. And you try and be a good person. Now, whatever you do in life builds this person's up. So whatever you do, it will lever this person's up and good. So if you do a lot of good things, this person is going to be more good. So everything is connected. Everything in life you do is connected to this Marvel character. And what you do is every weekend there's tournaments. And you can take this Marvel character and to fight. Like, with fight them, right? Fight it's like Pokemon. So it's Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> You guys, what do you guys think about that? You think Pokemon. Yeah, I'm down for it. But like, but like, their stats are based on just whatever you did. Whatever you, is connected. So to. if I ate five guys every day for lunch that week, then he, did, did that guy's gonna he's gonna. So uh, what about if Mickey got Steve Rogers, but because of Mickey's habits, he was fapped in America. He's, but he would be, but I see now also like let's say now if That's Mickey if, if, if Mickey let's say if Mickey was like good like he got Captain America right now Mickey Captain America he's like a very good guy right. Now, if you don't have good behaviors and you start doing bad stuff and you do bad behaviors, and it's going to affect his gameplay. Okay, so so are there multiple oh, wait, wait, Captain wait, wait, America? Wait, wait, could wait, we wait. both have Captain yeah, America? Could, yeah, hang on, hang on one second. Let's say I got Captain America right now. Mm-hmm. Is that and me? Is that the base base from baseline from there? Baseline. Because I'm not in the healthiest position right now, right? So does he like? Is he already unhealthy because I'm yes. unhealthy? So. So he just takes on what you do. Because so like, he, 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 if I had Captain America, would he be like a reactor? <clears throat> no, 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 no. He, he, you, all right, so they're going to physically fight each other, but they're going to have the physical prowess that you have, but they'll still have their powers. So imagine, that, let's get away from Captain America. Imagine if you had uh, Loki, right? Yeah. But his powers would be as strong as yours would be if you were Loki, so like kind of shit. <clears throat> So he's just like, he can't actually really do anything. Yeah, His transformations are half-assed. I don't, I don't he, can do, <laughs> he can do Bhangra. Yeah, and, uh, yeah, he's really good at Bhangra, but he's really <laughs> shitty at fighting. And also, like, Loki, Loki is like a, more like a villain, so like, so then you got to do but more like, bad things to be, make that person. So what's but the what question? if you're good with Loki, though? The huh? question is, would we play this game? Yeah, would you guys play this game? Yeah. Yes. And would you guys buy it? Uh, yes. Yeah. Well, then let's make this fucking happen, Pat. <laughs> okay. Did you just suggest magic? This was just a, a pitch. Oh, the pitch for <laughs> this was a, actually this, having this magic. Was, this was a Pat pitch. All right. Well, before we end it, Pat, who's your character? My character, Thanos. Yeah. Pick Thanos, right? Yeah. Wol- Wolverine. Um, man, I really want the homie T'Challa, but also I really fuck with Peter Parker. You know what? I'll leave Peter Parker for Spidey. I'm gonna go with T'Challa. No, Killmonger. There we go. Ooh, I they all kill. You're Killmonger. Ooh, Daisy Johnson. 
Daisy Johnson. I'm still standing for Daisy Johnson out here. She's coming. She's coming to the MCU, guys. She's going to be in She-Hulk. Is she going to be quaking it? Is she quaking it up? She's quake. She's quaking her balls she's off, quake. man. Well, I'm quite quaking my balls off. Quakers. <laughs> Quaker oats. Ladies and gentlemen, this has brought us to the end of the podcast. Brought to you by Quaking Your Balls Rain. Off. Spencer, Rain. hit the button, baby. Oh, Rain. stick around for the raid. Rain. Tell them the normie sitting in your regard. Yeah. The normie sitting in regard. Rain. Rain. Normie says in regard. Rain. Rain. Stick Rain. around for Rain. the raid. Rain. 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 Today's episode Rain. brought to you by Raid Shadow Rain. Legends, the Raiding. Talking normies like